Okay, but can I get started for you today? Have a great morning. Thank you, you too. Two hours later. Today with Andrew Flair. What's up? What's going on, dude? I'm excited. And his girlfriend, who is dead tired from our long walk. Have you ever caught a shark before, Andrew? I've never. I swam in the beach in the ocean for the first time yesterday. Wow. So I'm a newbie. We're breaking a lot of ground today. I'm a newbie. Well, let's make it happen. The good thing about this long walk is your bait usually thaws up before you get there. You just grab it, just grab it. Just hang on, just hang on to it, hang on to it, hang on to it. No, no, put it, put it between your legs. Look, he's jumping, he's jumping, he's jumping, he's jumping. There you go. Hey, hang on. <laughs> just hang on to it. You good? Yeah. <laughs> well, guys, I didn't even get to do an intro yet. I'm shark fishing. We're hooked up to a big shark right now. What's up? <laughs> look, at look at that drag screaming. <laughs> So I'm I'm out. So today I'm in, was a nice I'm enough I'm in night Florida. to get his girlfriend the first fish. Yeah, I'm I'm in Florida. And you know your girlfriend's a fish. You caught a bigger fish than you now. If she lands this, right? I know. Uh oh. I know. You got line tight. So just keep that line tight. That's all you got to worry about. All right. Okay. Go. While she's fighting that, let's rip and pop it and double. Okay. All right. Hey, so on your own. she's good. That is Josh Blacktip H. He's throwing poppers, like a like a topwater popper for sharks. And we've been here for five minutes and Macy already hooked into a shark, a black tip shark. So this should be this should be kinda interesting. I don't know what I'm doing. Just real, just real. You gotta real, 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 real. Alright, I'm gonna help you out here for the Yeah, okay. help her, yeah, help her. Okay. So Oh, he's still there. Okay. Thank God. I thought it came up. <laughs> so he's running. See when he's running? Yeah. You don't do anything. Okay. Okay. Now you're gonna use your body weight. You see okay. how? But you know like, what, like the other way is to go like this. Yeah. This is a better way. So the closer the reel is to your body, the more pressure you can put on the fish. Okay. So you see how I'm using my look, look, look I'm using my body weight. Yeah. Bending down, and I'm reeling. Okay. Let me drag a little bit more. Look at this. You're good. You see how I'm doing this? Yeah. This is much easier. Okay. <laughs> you're like this, and you're like, ah! <laughs> doesn't do anything. You know, and see how I'm like, bend your knees, one hand on the handle, one hand on the rod, okay. and you're using, you're putting your weight into this rod. Like I'm turning my body, I'm, I'm moving the rod with, with, with my hips. Okay. <laughs> okay? Okay. Keep that line tight. Okay. Don't put your yeah. knees together. Okay. You want, you want, you want Keep there spread, you go. Sp yep. spread apart a little bit. There you go. How much easier that is? Yep. There you go. You're doing a lot better now. There you go. Now keep going up. And then you, you can see, like you gotta pull, you gotta go downward. And then, there and then use your body, lean back. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, the fact that she got bit, we got, we got bit that fast. Look at that. Oh! Real, 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 real. My turn, my turn, my turn. Or you got, you got bit off. Let me see. You got bit off. Oh shoot! See what happened right there, guys? Is there's so many sharks here right now. That another one swam by and bit the line. They do that all the time. They just, they love biting fish in line for some reason. <laughs> they feel the vibrations of the line and they just come by and bite it. That's why it's kind of important to land them as fast as possible because yeah. the longer he's out there, the oh. more likely he is to get off. What a heartbreaker. Well, right, Andrew, you're up next. I'm dude. up next. She had a, she had her first shot. We're gonna, we'll probably catch some more, I would assume. I mean, it took us five minutes to hook the first one, right? Two minutes. Two minutes. <laughs> Two minutes. But, like Josh was saying, the, the sharks just bite the line. There's nothing you can really do about it. Once you hook one, you just want to bring it as quick as possible. That's basically all there is to it. I'm gonna. The only fish I know of. The, black the only fi the only fish is a black tip. So black tips intentionally target fishing line. It's a proven fact according to Josh. So I'm gonna throw. We're gonna throw some more live bait out there, which is what just got bit, and then I'm gonna try to catch one on a topwater popper. Like I, I love throwing topwater for bass. I'm gonna try throwing a topwater for shark. Popper like this. Popper. Uh, watch the lure. Light pop. You can pull too hard and you know, make more size here. Okay. And so you just keep it moving like that? Yeah, it's supposed to be interesting. Ooh. Oh! Oh! Oh my 
my god. Josh has had a black. That was sick. Josh has had a shark come all the way up and chase it. That was crazy. Oh. Oh, 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 he's right by it. Come on, eat it. Oh, he just blew up right next to it. Oh my god. I just had a good size black tip blow up on this, this popper. They keep missing it. We gotta, we gotta see if we can actually connect with one of these things. See, these things are freaking huge. Oh shoot! Oh my god! Oh! Oh! Oh no! Come on! Eat it! Oh my god! Yeah, all the way back! I just had one follow it. Oh, he's right there. He's right behind mine. Oh, they keep swirling on it. Come on. We found one that is, he's hungry. He just keeps missing it. That's the third time in a row he's hit eight. My arms are tired. I haven't even caught one yet. Oh, 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 oh get it, get it. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Josh just had one crush it. Oh, I wish I could show you guys this. We need to catch one of these things. I'm like freaking out. I'm freaking out. You watch that? Yeah. Oh, he's got another one following it. Come on. Oh, oh. Oh my God. Oh. You got him. You got him. No. I don't have him. Oh my gosh. I just had one. Oh. He actually ate it that time. I felt him. Oh, oh gosh. God. Come on. We got to hook one of these bad boys. They're, they're munching. I just had one come about four feet out of the water and just destroy this. How was that? Great. Well, you've just been standing here. <laughs> She's been holding down the fort on the live bait. Josh and I, we <laughs> went, topwater. we went top water fishing and had a ton of them chase it, like five or six. I had one that kind of grabbed it and I didn't get a good hook in him, but that's just. That's Josh was asking me, like, if this is a ten, what is bass fishing? And I said a three, and I haven't even <laughs> caught one yet. That just goes to show you how like insane. How hard did he hit your lure when he hit it? Yeah, just I mean they're like they come out of the water and like I, you guys probably couldn't see any of this on the GoPro. Kind of sucks. He actually has good footage on his channel, so if you guys want to see like what we're seeing, check that out because he's got like just epic 4K and slow mo. Mm -hmm. and all, just, all they have to type in on YouTube is type in black tip lure, and they'll see the shark out of the water. Okay, black tip lure. So type in black tip lure if you guys want to see just like these things just absolutely torpedo top waters. <laughs> But we're still we're still gonna try to hook into a hook into a shark here. We still got some still got some daylight left. As you guys can see, the sun's kind of up. But we're gonna hopefully hopefully Macy can actually catch a shark. You guys see how massive these things are throwing? I mean, this is like this is nuts. I've got a bunch of teeth marks in it. These things are not easy to catch. Lake Fork Guy, Lake Fork Guy took three years and like came out at least once a year, maybe even more. And he finally caught one like last week. So this is not easy, not easy at all. We're gonna see if we can make some magic happen today. Macy's still guarding the fort with the live bait. See if she can catch one out there. A few moments later. Well, topwater bites officially over. It's about nine o'clock. We had a ton of strikes, a ton of strikes. Had a lot of fun. Uh, now we're just throwing out live bait to see if we can actually land a shark. It's uh, that's why Macy came here. That's the only reason why she came here is to, to land a shark, right? Yeah. So we got like I think Josh said we have like an hour left of like prime time fishing. They feed in the morning, so we're hoping we're hoping that we can catch one in the next hour or so. Yeah, we're gonna try. I mean, it, we do it, our best. They're not easy to catch. You know, they're you not. Saw, 
when we got here, boom, boom. Yeah, I thought it was gonna be like lights out. We come really in like a minute. I, I did too, but. And then nothing. It was like they weird. ate and then they stopped and then we had them on top waters, but never actually got a hook in them. So they're not easy to catch, but hopefully, hopefully we can get, we can get lucky here. Yeah, we got cloud cover. That's good. Well, that's rain. Maybe not so much good. We'll see. How'd it go? Well. No good? I mean, we had an epic morning bite, but it lasted about an hour and then it just completely shut down and that's saltwater fishing for you. It'd be the greatest day of your life for about an hour, two, and then it's the worst day of your life. Pretty, pretty rough day. Didn't, didn't end, end up actually catching anything. Macy had the, uh, the only, the one and only shark hooked. And another shark, Josh said another shark came and bit the line. So it's not like, not like it just popped off or anything. It literally just bite the line because they're, they're stupid, I guess. And they think that line is something. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do the rest of the day. It's like 10.30 or so. Might go peacock bass fishing later today or probably tomorrow. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do the rest of the day. I'll take you guys along with me though. I'll keep the vlog alive. Hopefully, hopefully do something kind of fun. Yeah. This is much easier. Okay. <laughs> you're like this, and you're like, ah! I'm done. Doesn't do anything. 